All right, people. Welcome back. We're in Daily Duel, so we are joined by Omega Chaos. Hi, Omega Chaos here. Uh, we're playing Silent Swordsman, but like I said, I decided to change it from PK because I felt like it was too much PK, and decided to try Ignites with it, so I can Pendulum Summon level 5, and then possibly level up into level 7, because, yay, Silent Swordsman, besides just, you know, well, level 4 and then the quick play spell. So what are you doing today? Uh, trying that deck out? Mean? Oh, what are you trying? Are you trying out that deck that you tried last time that you couldn't get to work in? Yep. <laughs> if it doesn't work out, then... I will switch the deck. <laughs> Kill myself. <laughs> oh, are you just taking it slow, or yeah? Oh, right now, I had two summon strikes, but I only set one because of, I don't want to get twin blister. Oh my god, Stevie Warrior Lady. Well. <laughs> Lawyer Lee, loyally, she can, she can mess me up, <laughs> banish my pendulum ignite monsters. So uh, they already put Unite on my Geo Pro. That was, that was quick. So it's debatable on whether I wanna, wanna do that or not. Mm, how do I open? Oh, I opened up actually fairly decently, actually. Yeah. I set up my pendulum skills and actually pendulum summon. Wow, I opened up. Hmm. I can just. I wish I had another warrior because I, I can't summon Silent Swordsman. I have level five. I can just summon level five. I got nothing to do with that duty warrior lady right now. No, really. Yeah, that's the problem. I can summon my five, and then you know, wait, he's gonna come up. Oh wait, no, I forgot. I have Silent Sword, so I could just make myself unaffected by my opponent's card effects to the end of the turn, right? Yep. Yep. That's power. All right. So. Yep, so go ahead and Pendulum Summon. And so I can level 5. No, I'm gonna strike my own shit. <laughs> and send him away for just regular Silent Swordsman. Lols. Alright, so target one Silent Swordsman control, the target gains 1500 attack, and if it does, it's unaffected by your opponent's card effects in the turn, I can banish him to search it. Silent Swordsman monster. Alright, so I'll just go ahead and go into battle phase, and then play my, uh, my sword. It's power. <laughs> so I'll be unaffected by your DD warrior lady, so you could eat a fat dick. <laughs> I think you can activate in a damage stop as well, Paula. Yeah, I believe so, because it affects my attack. So you can just die. Yep, go away. That's power. Now I'll have a nice speed or two. I guess I'm gonna get my search. So powerful, so powerful that quick play. Hmm. I'll just get another one of you. Alright, so you can use my pendulum scales, I guess. <laughs> Between two and I'm seven. not high enough scales. Okay. Really? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, were you busting out like level eights? Yep. Alright, so I'll go up to 3,000, and I can negate spells, and that's power. That is so much power. <laughs> oh, that attack boost is actually permanent. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that attack that's boost good. is permanent, so... 3,000! I can negate spells. Oh. Uh, infinity dot deck? No, whoa, hello? Cosmo... Galaxy... <laughs> what is this? <laughs> I guess it wants to make the, make the infinite thing Cosmo, or something. <laughs> Alright, I guess. Yeah. Damn, Galaxy Soldier pitch, Galaxy Soldier for Galaxy Really minus in card for that uh, infinite. Uh, yep. That's crazy hard for that infinity. Just I can go ahead and hit you with that song strike. Nah. You don't need that infinity. <laughs> Oh, you still got your Cosmo plays, I guess. But you, you took you went crazy neg on that one. So what? Banish summon Dark Destroyer. Nope, just end your turn. All right. Oh, how fun dealing with the Cosmo guy during your turn. <laughs> At least I'll go up to thirty-five. So 
they probably want to see what he gets. Hopefully not Dr. Strayer. Yeah, hopefully. This will be a massive problem. Yep, freaking Dr. Strayer. I'm, I'm kind of debating on the Ignite ratio. The Ignite and Silence Sergeant's deck is really tight. <laughs> wow. Cosmos and Tag, ladies and gentlemen. Wow, I guess he already has the Dr. Destroyer. He's showing me Straw Man, Forerunner, and Slip Rider. And I guess I gave him Straw Man? Straw Man? Yeah, Straw Man. So he probably already has the Dr. Destroyer in hand. <laughs> yep, problem. Yep, 35. <laughs> do we even know what the other guy was running? I don't remember. Did he even do anything? Oh, he did the D Warrior Lady. I was like, cool, like, what the hell is that other guy doing? <laughs> and there's no set card, so we don't have to wait about like, a call the hunt or something. That set card means the other guys. So, hmm. what are you gonna do? Get ready to get hit with Dark Destroyer, because you know he has it. What? what? They quit? Uh, wow, wow, they quit. That's lame. Alright, be right back. Alright, that ended kind of anticlimactically. <laughs> oh, wow, all I got is a whole bunch of Ignites <laughs> and my sword. <laughs> I don't have any silent swordsman. Like, all right, great. Wow, just one set monster. Oh, mm -mm 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 -mm. uh, why? Why I always throw it in in opening hand like this? Because, because that's what you get for playing it. Because you already know. <laughs> all right, let's go ahead and trade in the yeah, Falgren. <sighs> what? Sun Dark Brave. Oh, you're gonna get twin twisted. Oh my god, you're gonna get twin twisted. <laughs> oh, fuck it, let's set this around then. Wow. <laughs> of course, you open up with it. <laughs> Go ahead. Twin twisters. Tachyon. Is it Tachyon? Tachyon? Yeah, it says Tachyon, yeah. Oh, well, no, not this deck. Oh, yes, this is deck. This should be fun. <laughs> No point in even striking it. Yeah, you can strike it, but it's still gonna be on the field. Yep. God damn it. <laughs> this should be fun. And by fun, I mean absolutely not fun. Ah, uh, don't you just love Magic Spectres? I thought Tugio Pro was a more casual place. I, I, thought, thought, it, I, thought, <laughs> I thought so too. I thought it was a more casual place. Like, nah. Magic Spectre, Cosmo, and Tag. Like, alright. I didn't say that ass crap on the background, no, just two. Wow. Wow, the sad thing is that none of my freaking Ignites are really strong enough to handle this situation. <laughs> oh, that sucks. My sword doesn't do shit. I also got Solomon's cards too. Wow, this is like, this isn't good at all. Yeah, I'll take the hit. I guess I could pop them and then search for a monster that's stronger. Yep. Yeah, do that. Oh, is there any monster who's stronger? No, not you. The other one. Isn't the other one stronger? Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead and grab him and then run your ass over. Way it's gone, and I don't have to worry about you actively having it for your turn. Let me attack you, unless you gotta play. You play your trap card when it banishes me. Is it a trap card that banishes me, right? There's my trap card. Yeah, there is one. Yeah, that's what you want to do. I just want to attack over you. Get you out of the way so you're not there to tribute during Omega's turn. <laughs> God damn, you got double strike. I got. A, I also got a strike and a warning. Yep, tornado. Yeah, seems like it. Alright, that's fine. Alright, so do you want me to set one of them or do you just want me to leave it alone because we already have two strikes? I guess maybe set the warning. Yeah, you, you can set it, I guess. <sighs> So, crap ton back row. <laughs> I 
seventh one is such a bluff that we can't even really do anything with it. It'd be nice if we could have used that as just a regular rank up spell. Mm -hmm. That would be pretty crazy, I would say. Mm -hmm. Just the one card chaos number. Mm -hmm. um, set up the Mali too. A twin Twister pitch stuff. Yep. Wow, and then just nothing, just in your game. Like, alright. Wow. Mm -hmm. More background. Yay. Oh, he got his back. <laughs> no, you get your money. <laughs> oh, we have his background. If you want to go ahead and do us a favor and set up your pendulum skill and then pendulum summon your uh, Mantis Specters, that'd be great. Don't normal summon. Damn. I guess that's why he's at standstill. Hell point. yeah, it is. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> I'll get aggressive with it. I'll fight. <laughs> oh my god, I knew it was Plague Shredder. I was like, watch it be Plague Shredder. How come we didn't do the Plague Mally combo right there? He would have double sync gate right there. That would have been power. Yeah. Oh my god, strike one and strike one and strike one. Close. <laughs> Just how much you do nothing. <laughs> That's so dirty. <laughs> Okay, now you're about to go off, right? You're about to use your Plague, you're about to use your Maui, like, let's go. Uh, I think this is the Maya Spectre player. I is it? I don't know. No, no, it's not. It's not, it's a zombie player. I, I can't even say the zombie player, just the Plague Maui player. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Actually, you know what? Probably should have said no to that. If I would have said no to that, then the play would have probably just ended. You already know that we have something back here for you. You already know. Uh, it's <laughs> You already know. Let's get this over with. Yeah, hopefully they don't have a key or something. <laughs> yeah. Definitely have has to strike that. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh, I'd say we'll make a put back plague for more shenanigans? No. Fuck you. Sorry, we opened up a butt ton of back row. Are you gonna go ahead and put your Omega back? That's fine. You gonna give us one of one of our cards or are you gonna turn on your own cards? Really? Okay. He's like, I'll return yeah, I could this. have put my feather on the back so I can't revive from the graveyard. That would have been smart. That's what I would have done. Oh shit! Duty <laughs> no. Warrior Lady again? Damn, Duty Warrior Lady. That was last duel, wasn't it? Is this the same guy? What the fuck is Duty Warrior Lady? <laughs> I'm not quite there at all. More background? Uh, not exactly. You can actually do a play? So you already know what that set card is. You already know that's uh, that's Tempest. That's Tempest, yeah. yeah so. so you're all clear to go. You can use my dig knife if you want to. Yeah, if it's a cool idea, mm -hmm. sure. I can actually do something kind of interesting, I guess. All right, do it. Now's the time to do it. They have no set background that we're not afraid of, and. We have the comfortability of two warnings and another strike, like this power. <laughs> uh, you gonna see those two? Yeah, I think it's still a pretty good play. Yeah, I'm going to that. Is she generic? That one dragon? Dra dragon eel? Yeah. Dragon. Jin. <laughs> yep. You just can't do anything. Can't get the effect, but it's uh, really good. Mm -hmm. You see, I have a nice 28 meter. That's cool. So that attack into that water lady? Uh, I don't know. What do you think? To get rid of it? Do you need or we can just uh, 
Do you need your ginger? No, yeah, I have to do it because I don't want my fellow to get nice. Oh yeah, that's true. <laughs> yep. Damn, D Y A, back at it again. <laughs> So if my Felgrant survives, I can do a rank 8 play next turn. Alright. And do I think it probably survives because we have so many Solans cards face down. I mean, it's not going to save you from Rodecki. <laughs> oh, yeah. Eccentric Archman. How is that? Yeah. So you're going to have Eccentric for days? I knew it! I knew oh, it! Man. Another Sorry. one! I'm like eccentric for days, yep. I don't know. Wow. And then do nothing with it. And then just do nothing with that, and then they quit. Once again, like, oh, wow. wow. Alright, another duel. That's a massive play next time, but... <laughs> Be right back. Alright, let's see if they quit again. <laughs> yep. Ah, uh, you drew the seventh one. <laughs> no, thankfully not. Okay. That's actually pretty good. Oh, and I've got a pretty decent hand this time. Got some dragon green. Guess get your fell ground set up. Um, yeah, I think so. I'm no, not sure what should send. I mean, you could send Arc Brave but then, and then revive it, but there's nothing to do anything with it right now. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Play seems a little aggressive. You could have probably took it a little bit slower. <laughs> I think I can send this. Oh, yeah, that works. Twin Twister will be kind of problematic for me. Yep. Just go ahead, Twin Twisters. Before you even get to use that Call of the Haunted. Ah! <laughs> Yuck, I hate this card. Yuck, I hate this card so much. <laughs> this is so good. Wow. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yep. Yep. At least you get to do that, but still. <laughs> And it's your favorite deck. Alright, well, so... Uh, my favorite deck is still Prophecy, but... Yeah, close to it, I guess. Eh, I guess we'll just sit here. Still don't really like this deck. So fucking searchy. Too well, searchy. some decks are like that, so... Too searchy! It's like one of the searchiest decks in all of Yu-Gi-Oh! Mm-hmm. Well, at least it's at least it's, it's not it's not broken at least. No, just just fucking ultimate falcon's a bitch. That's oh, right. No, it's not bad. Uh, wake me up when he's done with his turn. <laughs> we'll fall asleep. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm I wonder if he's actually going to rank up in this entire duel. Alright. Just drew a whole bunch of ignite stuff. I drew the more defensive ones too. Activate. Pop pop. Uh, will be my pendulum scale. You're two, you're seven, so I just need to beat her, actually. So who's my strongest Ignite? I think it's this sword guy. No, not him. It's another level six that's stronger than me, right? Yeah. Not really. You're only 21, 22, but I guess you're stronger. How strong are you? Oh, you're 24. Let me get you. <laughs> and I'll go ahead and play you. You and Pendulum Summon everybody. Mm 
Ah, Hag Knights. <laughs> mm, yep. Yep, that's all I got. It's attack over you, attack, attack directly. Use your pendulum base monsters to go back to accurate deck, so that's nice. Mm, possible booster strikes, but I guess not this time. No boost? <laughs> I got two twin twisters. I guess it's just that one. Oh, See you play it as well? Of course, twin twisters. So strong, you already know. <laughs> but it's not really good in your deck. You don't really have any anything good to discard. I don't care. I like popping back row. <laughs> Even when our back row gets popped, it's the fact that I get to pop your back row is nice too. Alright, Ray Raptors and Gadgets. Okay. I got nothing to stop you playing. Is it gadgets or is it like ABC? Yep. Yeah. Goddamn fucking <laughs> lithium. Fuck you. <laughs> yeah, I started to play that deck as well, but I play more of like I use pretty much everything, like X E X Y Z cards as well. Mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's not really that hard to summon, but of course, I don't harder than yep. ABC, of course, but. So. Yep. Yep. I already know, ABC is the goodness. No going all in. Wow. And why quick draw? Like, what is that doing in there? I guess because it's a machine that you can go to Ultimae with. Yeah. I'm not terrible, I guess. Oh yeah, I can't do anything for that. Hmm, yeah, this is not Sorry, good at all. No, it is not. <laughs> Crystal Myth? Beals. Or Belza. Mm -hmm. If I throw a revival card, that could be good. I wonder what that set card is. I mean, we're all in. Try not to talk into the lightning. Oh, no, it's instant fusion? Are you fucking shitting me? Wow. Ah, uh, okay. Go ahead and summon fucking Norden and... Oh, God. I hate you, Norden. I hate you so much. I wish you would die. Yeah, that's what you're going all in. Yep, why not? He opened up fucking perfect. Yeah, it doesn't, doesn't, doesn't even seem like an ABC deck. It's not like, like random. Why fucking not? This man opened up perfect. Like, God damn. Every single card in his hand was perfect wombo combo. Of course, lightning. Lightning and Tendra Flasia, lol. That would suck. What cost though? Mm -hmm. I guess bouncing your pendulum scales. Yep. Or something. Why not? Better than dealing with my pendulum scales. Wow. That guy opened up really well. Wow, am I still gonna use your effect? Thought you kinda hold off on that. Well, and now Twin Twister is pretty much useless because yeah, that there's... person didn't play any back row. No, didn't play any back row at all. Yeah, that's why I don't tend to play back row more in the main deck because it's not good all the time. Wow, and you're not going to use Castell. Fuck is wrong with you. Well, that's not terrible. But I say, do we lose like... it? <laughs> I say, do we lose it? Do you got to play? Because that is that's a difficult field to deal with. Oh, and you got Tan Harmon, so you can go ahead and send Arc Brave, and Arc Brave can at least banish something. Well, Arc Brave can revive Heligrand. Yeah. But it's still turned behind. Yeah. Gonna banish the Beals or the Castell. Be nice if you could just attack over the Castell. Mm, that's an interesting question. Uh, yeah, I think I should banish Castell. Can I deal with Beals? I wish I could look at my extra deck right now. Because uh, then it will have higher attack than Beals, uh, and yet the Lightning doesn't have any materials to use the effect anymore. True. We're not even considering the fucking Raid Raptor guy who just fucking plus hello and searched a lot, so. 
Yeah. Ah, this is a hard duel. Yep, drawing you six cards. Look at that. God damn. Yeah, you don't want that cast stealth spinning anything that you have on the field. The rest of your plays, I don't know. I just can't play that. He didn't use Castell. Why the fuck would you summon Castell and just leave it like that? Alright. Um, yeah, he's just the twice has like six cards. Like, And the fact that ABC twice meant to all of me are in a pretty bad position. Come on, rear after guy. Oh. What, you, did you thought that you had some fucking, <laughs> kind of fucking oh. synchro? <laughs> I'd be shocked if you did. <laughs> Except this foolish for Ultimaya. <laughs> yep. Yep. More searching? <gasps> it's unheard of. Rear after's doing more searching? Yep. Yeah, my Falcon is still probably going to get cast out. Yep. The quarter is vanishing, don't give a fuck. Oh, nope. Or Never. not. Or not. I say, are we actually going to survive a turn? <laughs> no, the Revolution Falcon could be a play, so. We are still in trouble. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh-huh. Did he search with, uh, Nest? Nope. Mm. That Sun was definitely a misplay right there. Yeah. Sunzy, corn, search. You can't have enough searching. Now when you actually decide to do something, <laughs> your partner, tag partner went all in. Oh shit. Or that card. Yep. Oh that shit. Is yep. Yeah, I think you up. still survive. No. Or not. Because it's I think it was timing. <laughs> yeah, oh. this is definitely not good. Mm-mm. I gotta fucking, I gotta handle that build, and I also gotta handle that to my Tokyo Lightning. It's not too much of a threat. She's 25, and then, of course, that Blade Falcon. Like, all right. Ah, oh, this is gonna be difficult. You actually had a rank up card. I'll give that to you. At least you did something. You got any back row? Wow, just shuffle your hand and then, alright. That's not really what I needed. What do I have? At least you have some, something in your inner so you so can do some plays. I have depended on someone. What fibers do I have? All I have is fives in, in one six. God damn it. <laughs> and all I drew is into in silence, so it's like, I got Volcosaurus, what the fuck is that? Does that do to Beals? Uh, I feel like that's the problem right now. <laughs> Nor did I draw into another Ignite to go ahead and pop and do that play. God damn it, I don't think, I don't think we're gonna survive. Yeah, I think so as well, because... I think we have to it. get rid of the place Falcon, but then we have to deal with the rest of the field, and then we are still screwed. Yeah, I can deal with Utopia, the Lightning, and Blaze Falcon, but I cannot deal with, of course, Ultimaya with Beal. I can't deal with Beals. <laughs> I don't think there is a rank 5 generic that can deal with the Beals. Nope. This sucks. Uh, this sucks so bad. Yeah, I mean, I had Brandol, uh, Zamayo, and Volcosaurus. I can go Volcosaurus, blow up the Utopia and the Lightning, and then attack over the Falcon. It's like the best play I got, but not only did I do with Beals, but the other guy has no cards in his hand. Knowing our luck, he might draw into something he could set and then have Ultimaya go off again. 
Yeah, I think that's the best play I can pull off right now. <laughs> oh right, I forgot about that. Oh yeah, I saw that. <laughs> oh my god, I completely forgot about that. Fucking bills, damn it. <laughs> At least Avis the player doesn't have any cards in hand. Yeah, but like I said, no one gets that. No one But like, if they top just... deck a back row card, then yeah. gets the ultimate effect again. Then yeah. Then, uh, Good. Then we're screwed. <laughs> now I'm drawing a fucking silent sword, but that's not what I need to draw into at all. No, there's no point in sending veteran to summon silent swordsman. We just have the booty. I don't know, he might draw into a spell. I could always just tag out. Yeah, you know, that might be better. Yeah, that's better. You go back and have a check and summon you. So at least this can float into another silent swordsman. Yep. <laughs> Go ahead and set that card and then. Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> Alright, killing myself now. Killing myself. Wow. Wow. Alright, well, we lazy. Oh, there's Crystal Meth. Wow. This yeah, man opened really it. Sucks. This man just drew perfectly. I know. I. I don't think there's anything I can even draw that can get me out of this situation. Especially if Chris Dalling on the field, like, what can I do against that? Fucking nothing. Lose. Nope. Go ahead and say Crystal Myth Negate. Yep. Yep, we lost. This man opened up perfectly. Wow. I'm getting real sick and tired of Ultimaya. Like, holy shit, Ultimaya is so fucking good. They starting trying to get abused in a lot of a lot more decks now. And is there Thursday another instant fusion? Another well, instant fusion. That definitely wow. wasn't a good draw. So we lose pretty much. Yay! Alright, awesome. Because I could like drag a wine for Arc Prey, but that's way too late. Yep, and then you uh, just get the game crystal gate. meth anyway. Yep, that's game. Alright, so we're done. That's thirty something minutes. So, ugh, goddammit. Like, I can't believe that guy opened up so well. Like, just randomly throw in a fucking... Like, just a quick draw with the fucking Gem Knight to fuck us. Like, so sick and tired of Ultimaya. Yeah, Why I did didn't Ultimaya... even summon the ABC Dragon anyway. Nope, didn't just even summon on ABC. Didn't do gadget <laughs> plates. It was literally just quick draw that was randomly thrown in with a fucking Gem Knight. Seraph. Yep. Yeah. Did we know? I guess we should have twin twisted the frick. I should have twin twisted the frickin' uh, the Gem Knight thing. Your night fusion. That would have been nice. Maybe I should have banished the uh, bells there, uh, but I don't think it would have changed anything because we would have used Costal then and all that. So. It might have. Because if you would have banished bills and he would have spun you with Castell, then I could have summoned, attacked, attack, and handled everything. Yeah, you know what? You should have, you should have banished bills. Yep. I thought I could handle bills, but I didn't know what cards I had. I couldn't handle bills. That was the problem that we ran into. An empty Castell that would have spun you back. That's fine, but I could have handled the rest of the field, including killing the Ultimaya. You had the top deck into Insta Fusion. Insta Fusion into. I don't know. Because he already uses one Norton, so. I don't know. Yeah, we should have banished the Bills. Oh well. Hindsight's 2020. <laughs> Alright, anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed. Thank you, Omega, for joining me. No problem. Glad to join you always. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all support. And I will see you guys tomorrow playing them Skull Servants on. Special day. <laughs> what do you mean special, special day? Wednesday's my birthday. Oh, that's <laughs> nice. I guess happy early birthday. Yep. <laughs> Alright, people, thanks for watching.